Welcome back. It is time to dig into our pizza pie. I'm it excited. Is. Now this is one, like we said, it, the one that was fully prepared by your students. Yes, this one's fully prepared by my students. They had a lot of fun doing this one, and I hope it comes out as good as they hoped it would. How long did you end up cooking this one? This one cooked for about 50 minutes. 50 minutes at 375? At 375, okay. and it cooks all the way through. So we're, I've already sliced it to pull out everything. It raises quite a bit too. So, and I, you know, I asked him, during the break because we saw the, the crust on the other one, how it was sinking in and like pulling away from the edges. So it pops back out. Look at that stretch oh. on that cheese. Did they put more cheese on it than you did? Yes, they did. Okay. Definitely appears that they put more cheese than I did. <laughs> Just wondering. But I probably would too, I'm, I'm a cheese fan. I do like cheese, but I like to do a blends of cheeses. Um, the Fiesta mix. Mm -hmm. where it's really got a little bit of taco seasoning in it. It's Colby Jack and mozzarella and some cheddar. I really like that one. Um, mozzarella straight all the way through. Cheddar inside of it works for me. So just about anything. So I this, definitely just to recap, this one has lamb, it has beef, the vegetables in here. We've got peppers. Several peppers. Uh, I believe it has green bell peppers, red bell peppers, uh, yellow bell. It has some sweet peppers in it, and I think it's even got a couple of serranos in there. Oh, okay. So. Well, I gotta get some bread with it too. Bread and a little meat, and it's. And it's very much so, it almost texturally and looks, appears to be a lot like a shepherd's pie. Yeah. So, without we were the, about without the potatoes, potatoes, yeah. Okay, so it's we were, very cheesy. <laughs> Well, the my students do love their cheese. So. I'm going to cut some of this cheese off, try to be appropriate putting it in my mouth here. Yeah. Okay. All right. What do you have your students working on next in class? Uh, they're working on pasta right now. Oh, awesome. So we're going to do pasta, and then we're going to move into soup, and then they're going to learn the chicken and dumpling soup that we made last year. Hmm. So we're going to move, keep on trucking right all along the lines. That's really good. Isn't that great? Wow, what a fun idea, too. And it made a huge pie. I was worried that, like, when we were putting it together, I was like, mm, it's not going to serve a lot of people, but when and, it rises up. Yeah. And when you, it's just like any other pie, you cut it into however many slices that you want. That's amazing. And you make enough filling, you could do two. That's really good. You can find the ingredients and the recipe for the dough and how to make all of this on our website, koamnewsnow.com. Just click on the morning show link and you can find all of, all of these segments together in one under mm -hmm. Chef Anthony. Wow, do you have any idea what we're gonna work on next? Cause you know what, next week is special day. No, Valentine's is the week after that. Well, it would be, yeah, but what is next week? It's not parent-teacher conferences. <sighs> <laughs> You're being cheesy. Yes. I am being cheesy. Well, we are preparing for the Super Bowl. Yes, we are. We're also preparing for a big day next Thursday, February 9th. Um, Do you remember it? My mom's birthday is Close tomorrow. Oh. I need to make sure and call her. <laughs> my birthday, you know that. <laughs> I couldn't give in too easy. No, I know, I know. But they, my students did have a question for you. Okay. How much did the chimney cost on your house? I don't know. It's on the house. <laughs> you can do have jokes all morning long, all morning long oh, with yes. Chef Anthony. Wow, okay, well this is really good. I'm looking forward to this and you're just gonna keep me a surprise for next week, I That's guess. That's right, I'm not all gonna right. let you know because it is your birthday week. We have to keep it under wraps because... We'll be making a Bert Tanya's birthday surprise with Chef Anthony next Thursday. Stay tuned for that for yes, sure. Yes, we will. All right, we'll be right back.